tractor engines lit on Super Heavy as it starts to ascend skyward. Coming up on Max. Wow, Dan, that was incredible. <laughs> we could feel the building shaking here, feel. See those engines powering down? Booster engine cut off. Ship ignition. Stage separation. Incredible flip by Super Heavy Booster, and you can see those six engines, those three engines on the ship ignited. Six healthy Raptors <laughs> running on ship on its way to space. Peak that engine view, booster doing the boost back. Chris, how's it looking over there at Hawthorne, man? Reminder, we are not recovering the super heavy booster today. We are instead going to do some- Booster back, shut down. And there we had a good shutdown of the boost back burn. We've done this in wind tunnels. We've done this in computer modeling. It shows that sometimes the control isn't great. We are going to relight 13 engines, then bring that down to three engines. As, as we talked about earlier, we will be intentionally booster shutting down as the super heavy booster is making its way back down to Earth. We can see those grid fins doing some heavy work. Booster landing start up. Ignited for our landing burn. Does look like we lost telemetry from the booster once we started into that landing burn. Did you see your confirmation that the booster did demise? Ship engine cut off. It ignited all six of its engines and made it all the way through Seco just now. Start dispensing those Starlink yeah, similar. What a great right view! Right at the bottom of the stack, <laughs> so should be should be able to see them kind of firing out from right there. So really cool. It was unable to actuate all the way open, so they are gonna close it back up. Hal told me no. Seconds. It's one hell of a sight from here. We see it arcing right over top of us. We see 33 out of 33 Raptor engines lit on Super Heavy as it starts to ascend skyward. Coming up on maximum aerodynamic pressure, then only about a minute nice and a half until we get into hot staging. All right, hot staging, about 30 seconds. And definitely keep an eye on which way the booster peak that engine view, booster doing the boost back. Chris, how's it looking over there at Hawthorne, man? It is looking pressure, chamber pressure. Only one way to really prove it out, and that's to get real world data. So here comes super heavy. It should be the cool part is when we get to re-entry, it's going to be daytime. Yes, and we did that on purpose so that we can get some live daytime views as ship is returning back to Earth. 